And speaking of all stars and top dogs, Westmont High School's Zachary Taylor is a GSF all star. And I went over to his game against Lee this past Thursday. I got highlights coming up. All right, guys, introduce yourself. Shake hands, please. Don't forget, seniors, if you would like to play in the first ever GSF All Star game in December, make sure to have your coach, mom, dad, guardian, AD, or even your teacher nominate you by going to the GetSportsFocus.com website and filling out the online form right in the front page. We are looking for mostly CCS players with 3.0 GPA. Yes, you got to be smart to be part of this thing. And if you are from the NCS, AAA, OAL, or even Sack Joaquin, you're definitely welcome to be part of it. But the registration, or it's not registration, the nomination will end this week. So November 27th is going to be our first meeting, and it will be at the GSF Top Dog 3 football camp which is now available for everybody to register in uh, and go to our website, go to the tab that says events and you will see GSF Top Dog 3 football game. For details, go to the website. I know you guys have questions. Get Sports Focus is brought to you by Summit Partners, leaders in growth equity investing, Ike's Love and Sandwiches, championship level sandwiches every single time. Weightsandbars.com. Build your home gym and shop locally from the Bay Area's best fitness equipment experts. And by South Bay Construction, a reputation built on trust. 6-0 Warriors versus 0-6 Longhorns. Kind of a mismatch, but I really wanted to see Warriors' playmakers number nine from Lee, Cheyenne, Shariat. He actually made the play right there on kickoff. Nice return by Gavin Garcia. First drive for Westmont. Didn't work as planned. But that was a nice pass from QB Zach Zapita to Mason Price. Our heroes. Longhorns first drive, first play. Cheyenne got the handoff. Brought down by Taylor. Taylor actually had at least eight tackles in the first half. I just want to show you guys those two players to start with. Westmont started their next offensive drive inside the five and on the third play. Jacob Lang. Look at that hole. We need Lang and his right tackle on the GSF All-Star team as well. Seven to nothing. He scored, but I got bumped by the Warriors sidelines. <laughs> they got all excited and forgot that I was there. But it was a 97-yard touchdown. For Lang. I really like how Lee fought back though. Cheyenne is their guy and he almost broke loose a couple of times. Nice kickoff return by Kai Cho by the way. He was tackled by number 85 whose name is not labeled on the Max Prep roster but Cheyenne had over 100 yards in this game and he kept Zach Taylor and the defense busy. 7-zip Westmont after one. Second quarter. There's our GSF All-Star Zachary Taylor making sure I got highlights of him in this thing. Another tackle for my man. Why is my voice cracking? Lee had to settle for a field goal. 7-3 with 9.06 left in the first half. That was Cam Cheer with the boot. Next Warrior possession. We get the Jacob Lang show right here. My man looking like Saquon Barkley. There goes 85 again with a big block this time. Next play. QB keeper for Zach, the other Zach, the QB Zach, another first. And I like the mix right here. Zepeda to Price. Heroes, baby. Nice truck. And they wrapped it up with this. Nine plays, 68 yards, capped off by Lang. Easy money. 14-3 Warriors just before the half. Attention college coaches, check out this grab by Mason Price. QB done. Right. Score remain 14-3 at intermission. Lee was moving the ball, but Alexander Briscoe, number three, stripped it loose and returned it all the way just outside the 30. And on the very next play, Zach Zapita says, I got this, 33 yards to the house. Westmont is now up 21 to three. Lee answered, QB Aaron Reed to Kai Cho. 
That was a beautiful catch by Chad. Beautiful. Cut the lead 21 to 10. Longhorns with some work to do. 432 left in the third. Westmont, they just stuck with the script. Lang led the attack and got it inside the red. Zapita threw another dime out to Price. First down. And then this, touchdown number three for Jacob Lang. Nine plays, 70 yard drive, and that took about four minutes and 10 seconds off the clock. It was 28 to 10 after three quarters. Fourth quarter, third and long situation for Lee. Pass attempt, batted down by Fabian Gomez Rodriguez. Nice play, next play. They try to fake it, but heads up play by the defense. That was a punt that didn't go so well. So Westmont took over, and of course, they gave it to Lang. Back-to-back, -to -back, touchdown number four for Jacob Lang. That made it 35-10, to 10, Warriors. Might as well show you all the scores. Zapita added one more for the Warriors right there. That was a third and goal situation from just outside the 20. His second touchdown of the game. Nice hustle, Lee. They did score a late touchdown to give the home crowd something to cheer about. Final score, 42 to 17. Westmont remained unbeaten, undefeated. And I was able to do a GSF Uncut interviews with Lang, Taylor, plus Coach K. And that is coming up. You're watching Get Sports Focus, baby. No. <laughs> 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 <laughs>